Welcome to another session of algorithms. In previous sessions, we looked into the Q quick find approach, <coughs> quick find eager approach, and also we had a demonstration. So let's see how is quick find. So quick find is too slow. So if you look at the cost model number of array accesses for read and write so there are too many too much of that and we, the algorithm quick find to initialize it should run in a number of times union to check union it should run in again in number of times so order of growth of number of array accesses so what is the defect of quick find the union is too expensive so we look into this order of growth uh, in detail manner in future sessions so order of growth union is too expensive because to initialize it should run n times and for the uh, for the union we have to run again n times so there's a performance issue so in the future session we will be looking into the performance approach so let's see the order of growth so it takes quick find takes n squared array accesses to process sequence of n union commands on n objects so this is very important quick find takes n squared array accesses to process sequence of n union commands on n objects so that is too much when you look into the performance accept aspect so as a solution we have quick union lazy approach let's see what we have to do <coughs> so in the next session in this session we will be looking at the quick union lazy approach so integer array id of size n interpretation idi is parent of phi so root of phi is checked for example in the diagram root of 3 is 9 so if you go here and here you can see keep going until it doesn't change so algorithm ensures no cycles so it finds the root so let's see so here for example in the first diagram image root of 3 is 9 root of 5 is 6 you can see root of 3 is 9 root of 5 is 6 so find find operation check if p and q have the same root so now we check the root so previously we checked the id now we check the now we are looking at the root so if check if p and q have the same root so in the example 3 and 5 are not connected because root of 3 is 9 root of 5 is 6 therefore 3 and 5 are not connected so that is about the find operation so let's see the union operation to merge components containing p and q set the ids of p's root to the ids of q's root so id of p is replaced by the id of q so in the example this is very easy so id of p So id of p is root so id of p is root so p is here so i p is 3 and q is 5 so p is 3 and id of p is root is 9 so id of p is root is replaced by the q's root p's root is 9 q's root is 6 so therefore this 9 will be replaced by 6 in this example. So this is highlighted. ID of P's root which is 9 is replaced by ID of Q's root which is 6. Therefore 9 is replaced by 6. Only one value changes. So it's a simple example 
that's the end of the session so we, here we looked into the quick union lazy approach for the find operation check if p and q have the same root union to merge components containing p and q set the id of p's root to the id of q's root so id of p's root is replaced by the id of q's root so here 9 is replaced by 6 that's the end of the session